So what's up YouTube, it's your girl it's Brilli, and I am back with another video and as you guys saw by the title, you already know what we're doing today so today I'm actually really excited about this video, that's why I'm smiling so hard <laughs> but anyways, I'm sitting on the floor today, my setup is different, I'm actually sitting in front of the window and I'm still a little sick so please mind, you know, excuse my voice or whatever but today we're going to be doing a video on back to school school supplies, okay? So, I'm really happy to do this video. I'm going to be showing y'all everything that I got. And I did record a little clip when I was at the store today. And when I say a little clip, I mean like a little clip. Like we were in a line. And I'm just like, okay. You know, this is stuff we got or whatever. And so, I'll roll that clip. So y'all can see. It's really short. And I was looking a mess. Probably still looking a little bit of mess. But, I mean, don't judge, honey. So, yeah. Okay, you two, so we are in Walmart, and it's early in the morning, so I look a mess, okay, like we all look a mess, but we were getting school supplies, we were school supply shopping, and I'm going to show you guys what I got, I'm going to show you guys some of the stuff that I got, but today I will be recording the video and showing you guys everything that I got for back to school, school supply shopping, so this is what I got right here. And some of this stuff is my sister's. It's not all my stuff because we do not need all this stuff that we're going to high school. So I will be recording the video later. And I will be showing you guys everything. So I will see you guys there. Let's go. So I am in high school. I'm a sophomore this year. If you guys didn't know, I'm going to be a sophomore. Yes, 10th grade. And so, honestly, when you're in high school, you don't need that much stuff. I don't care what grade you're in. You really don't need that much stuff because... I mean, it's high school, and so I'm going to start off with, well, I'll just start off with paper. I got two um, college rule papers with 150 sheets, you know, all together, so 300 sheets in total. And, yeah, college rule, y'all like college rule, raw rule, kind of, I don't really like it like that, but college rule, paper, two of them, and I'm sorry if, like, the setting is a little weird i am recording my sister's room today because there's more space in her room so yeah that's what i decided to do and then i did open some of my stuff already so yeah like it, everything won't be in packages and everything like that because it's like i already opened it whatever so next i have these two notebooks they're really cute to me uh, i got these two notebooks in total i think i got like six notebooks because i really don't need that many notebooks but I really just got the basic stuff, so these are two cute notebooks. One is black with gold, detailing the things, and then this one is black with gold, blue with gold, and they're really cute. And then, of course, since it's like tax-free weekend, yeah, it's tax-free weekend, so go get you some uh, Christmas colors. I got a red and green notebook, and I got six in total, um, and then I got two black notebooks. So, yeah. Ooh, that kind of look good. Huh. Um, so, yeah, that's the six notebooks I got. Just something simple, honestly. This video may be short, and I apologize if you wanted it to be longer. Um, but, yeah, that's that. The paper, two packs of paper, six notebooks. You really don't need much. And if you get a lot and stuff like that, you still going to have some probably for the next school year, depending on how your school works, whatever. Then I think I got... How many folders did I do? I got five folders. I got different colors. Um, and then some I did color coordinate. But I got this pink folder. This will go with one of my black notebooks. Yeah, it does. It probably doesn't look pink on camera. I hope it does look pink. I think it does look pink on camera, though. It looks pretty pink to me on camera. So, yeah, it looks pretty good. Then I got this red one. This will go with my red notebook. Um, I got it. And then, oh... Okay, I also want to say, folders like these last longer. Like, if you get paper folders, they will eventually rip. They won't last long, and they begin to look ugly after a while. So, get folders that aren't paper. They last longer, and they look better, too. This green will go with my green notebook. Um, blue one. I don't have a blue notebook. I don't know, honestly. Now, this will go with my black notebook, too. And then this one can go with any notebook that I didn't match up yet. 
So, I like the color coordinate mine. Even if, even if the colors don't match, at least they go together. The black and blue one. Pink and black. Green and green. Red. Red. And then black and black. And then this one. I, I still have extra folders in my room that I actually have from last year. I have like a lot of folders actually left. Uh, I probably will go get those and just show you guys that I get a lot of extra school supplies. Um, not purposely, but just by accident. And then, okay, I'm getting messages, y'all. So I'm kind of looking at it because I record on my phone. Um, but, yeah, I get a lot of different school supplies that I never actually end up using. Even though, like, I have eight classes and things like that. So, then I have my pencil case. And I would recommend getting a clear pencil case. Like, it can have, of course, like, detail and everything, but... When you get like um the cloth on um, pencil cases, it get written inside by the pencils. Like because these pencils come sharpened, it will write inside and then it begins to look dirty. Like you can wash it and everything, but I mean clear is better. Um so you already know the classic classic cutaway. Mechanical pencils. I got a pack of these and I don't know how many. I think about like 12 or something like that. 12 came in there. And it was just like a dollar and like some change. So it was like 12 pencils like that. And then I also got 12 of these pencils. 12 regular pencils. And I would recommend like, I don't know, get both. But don't take all your pencils to school at one time. Separate it throughout the year like... You do not have to take 24 pencils to school. Like, what's the point? You're not going to use all 24. Take, like, you can take, like, four pencils a day. Maybe your friend need a pencil, get him a pencil, and you have two pencils. Just in case one break, and then, you know, you have your backup pencil and everything like that. And then I also got four pens. Um, I got two black pens because they always come in handy. And then I got two color pens. Only because it comes in handy when you are taking notes and you want to color coordinate so you know, like, especially in math class or English or something, you take a lot of notes in both of those classes. Um, so, yes, get your pens. Make sure they're really nice. These are paper made. Paper made pens are really good. Not sponsored. Love to be one day. But I'm serious, but I mean, you know. So, yeah, get you pens. Oh, and then I also got these really cute erasers, you guys. These erasers are so cute. It says, oh, hey. I mean, this one is kind of, like, basic. But I still like it. I think it's really cute. And then I, it's a skate pencil. I mean, eraser. It's cute to me. And I'm like, girl, it's just an eraser, okay? And I think it's cute. <laughs> so, that's... Uh, oh, wait, I'm not done binders so i got this little binder i'm not sure it's probably like three inches i think this is the three inch binder and i also have dividers i have a lot of dividers i didn't even have to buy any um dividers really help to when separating different notes separating units and things like that so just a um, regular black binder a binder that i actually had already from last year that i didn't use so it's coming in handy this year and then this is another binder. I have paper in it because this is this will be my math binder. But I'm thinking about kind of getting a smaller binder for math. But this has wild wool paper in it. I also had this um, binder from last year. Well, I got two of them. I had got two binders like this. Used one for last year, my ninth grade year. And then I'm using this one for this year, my sophomore year. And it's always good to have a binder for math because you can keep everything organized. Or just a binder for anything because organization is key to success. Well, it's one of the keys, you know, to success. It really helps. And then I also have my emergency kit. It still has a tag on it. Let me take this off. And this is so cute to me. And I did get all of this stuff from Walmart. Um, well, besides my binders, I didn't get these from Walmart. 
um, because I already had these. But other than that, I got all of my pencils, you know, my paper and everything like that. My folders and everything like that from Walmart. My pencil case. This pencil case. Well, my emergency kit. Um, and I will do, be doing a video on a, a school emergency kit. Um, everything that you need inside it. Um, I'm not done, you know, filling it up and everything like that. But I do have some of my stuff in here, you know. Perfume, hand sanitizer, chapstick, more things. Um, and so that is that. And so this video was actually pretty short. But honestly, that's kind of all it is. Oh, and then also my backpack. So my school requires us to wear either mesh or clear backpacks. And so I just has it like I got this mesh um, backpack. Um, it's not a new one. Uh, this is actually the one that I got in the middle of the year because the first one that I had, which was actually a clear one, broke. So I'm not going to be getting a new backpack this year, but I will be getting um, a backup one just in case this one decides to give up on me, okay, before the end of the school year. Um, I wish you all luck, freshmen, sophomores, juniors, seniors. Seniors, I hope you go off and do amazing things. Juniors, I hope you prepare because you're going to be seniors next. And well, I'm going to be a junior, but... My sister decides to walk in when I'm ending it, but I hope you guys <laughs> enjoyed this video. It was really short, and yeah, I didn't want to—I didn't want to keep y'all too long, and I don't want to keep y'all long now because I'm kind of talking a lot. Um, so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, please comment down below if you enjoyed or like some video ideas. Like, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Okay, and I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys subscribe. Watch this video, show some love. Um, you can get my social medias. I'll put my social medias in the description. And they will also be in basically a D about on my YouTube channel. So I thank you guys so much for watching. 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 And once again, it's your girl, Brindley. And I'll be back for another video. So, peace.